Okay. So... Let me see. So we've got... We've got things to buy from this guy. I can't imagine he has too many new things. He's got the Mass Fragment. He's got the Lunified Lantern. Okay. Yeah. Let's go check out uh, Fart Cloud Topia. And, uh... Oh! Hello! Pale thing, you wear that nail with ease. If you're in search of combat, you'll find no great warriors in this decaying burrow. I heard an arena exists somewhere below, one built for our like. Meet me there, and we'll test what your skills what skills you possess. I'll be heading down soon. Come and find me, if you dare. Oh, that's cool. I love the NPCs in this game. They're really fun. Like, it's it's really cool, uh, just how many like different bugs and unique characters that they've managed to cram into this game. Okay, so let's go down to... Uh, let's go down to Queen Station and... see what's a doodling. Because if we're lucky, um... If we're lucky, maybe we can find a, like, combined map for the Fog Canyon. And otherwise, like, that, that'd actually probably be the best. I don't know. I just wish there was almost like a... Uh, what am I thinking? Like a notification or something? Or a indication of where... Uh, I guess we might as well hit up this bench, just in case. Um, but like, uh, some kind of like... Easy, easy indication of where the map maker is. Because if you miss him, it sucks. Because you're pretty much out in an entire area, exploration-wise. Okay. Yeah, so let's let's see about fart bag. <laughs> well, that was a sound effect. Are there are they actually dangerous or are they just Are they just mildly inconvenient? Unfortunately, we need we need double jump, I think. I'm betting that's the that's the next thing we get. Cause he is too high up for me me to be able to take on. At least right now. Let's see, did I read the map marker card? Uh I've read a map marker card, but I don't think I've missed the map maker. Okay, these are oh. This is really cool. I dig this. That's just a fun little thing. Hello, what are you? Proud look at little looking mushroom critter do. What biome I am, am I in now? Ow. Ah, ah, ugh. So this guy's got mushrooms growing on him, and he mushroom attacks. Okay. Well, that's fine. Okay, and it looks like this is a dead end. Well, that, this was interesting. So yeah, we need, we need whatever the wall climbing thing is next to progress through this zone. I guess I haven't been this way yet, have I? Oh, hey, here he is. Ah, oh, my short friend, you've caught me at the perfect time. I'm just about finished charting these noxious caverns. Very territorial types that make their homes within this area. I'd suggest avoiding them when possible. Further below, some strange thin creatures gave me quite a scare. They seemed an intelligent bunch. In my youth, I'd have braved their caves, but I fear my matured physique wouldn't be able to outrun them where they turn vi when they turn violent. Purchase map of the area, yes. Okay, so what do we got? Uh, so we don't have a map for Fog Canyon, but we do have a massive map for this entire area. Of course, I don't know if I'm going to be able to navigate it necessarily, but still, at least we have a map. Uh, 
Let's see. Still not sure if I'm immediately going to be able to get around here. Let's see if I can lure the chargey beetle man. Okay, so this guy is also another mushroom beetle. Interesting that there's multiple types. I'm glad. I like variety. Okay. So what else do we got around here? Might as well explore what we got the moment. Okay, so we got something up here. Ah! What? Well, we have more explosions. Well, that's... Huh. Righto, then. So we got the hollow nest seal. Okay, I want nothing to do with any of this area. Screw it, we're out. <laughs> That's too scary. <laughs> it's too much death. Okay, uh, let's see what the hollow nest seal does. Oh, it's, um... Wait, what? Oh, here it is. What's this? Official seal of the kingdom of hollow nest, symbolizing the authority of the king and his knights. Relic from hollow nest past. This item now holds little value except for those dedicated to hollow knights... Or, the uh, kingdom's history. Okay. So it's like a collectible token type thing. I thought it was an uh, I thought it was an upgrade. I feel like there's got to be a. Uh I feel like there's got to be a uh, trick to killing those explodey guys. Let's see, do I know if this game's coming out on the Switch? It will be, but I don't know when it is uh, when it's coming out on the Switch. Okay. So I can't exactly um, give a whole lot of help. What's this supposed to be? I have no idea what that's supposed to be. All right, yeah. So I, I know it's coming. I know this game is coming to the Nintendo Switch. They've confirmed it. Their website has it. Uh, main thing is, there's no like official confirmation on the like exact uh, win of it all. So I don't know. Be patient, I guess. This is a mini boss. Or mini something or other. Guess not a mini boss, just. Just very distressed. At least they don't explode. But yeah, I've uh, I've talked to a couple of developers actually. Um, they've been particularly uh, complimentary of the Switch as a whole. Saying that it's so much easier to de develop for than uh, than the Wii U was, and like, you know, it's actually a platform that's going to get indie games, which is I'm super excited for. There's uh oh shoot, I'm trying to remember. It has been Heroes is coming out on the Switch, not quite at launch. No. Uh, not quite at launch, but uh, has been Heroes looks like it's going to be absolutely great. I'm I'm excited about it. <sighs> they're not dangerous. They're just slightly annoying. Oh, get back here, you little shroom! They don't even give me any money. All right, well that's fine. Oh, hey, where is this? Oh. 
I'm super confused. Where are we? I've been here before, yeah? Oh, we're here. It's just a short little side cut. Why? I don't know. I guess we can go up here, so we might as well... Check it out. Now this... This is a mini boss. Man, don't give yourself a hemorrhage. Or, ow! Oh. So that's a prabble. I guess the trick is you have to alternate between both mushrooms. Well, that's actually... That's kind of fine, actually. Love the mini boss design in this game. Super satisfying. Ow. Charge up again. Just gotta make sure we don't get smack or rude. Charge. Ugh. Unfortunately, until I kill one of them, healing seems moot. At least we killed one of them. Makes my life easier. Well, while well, he's doing that, well, that's a good time to heal. Yeah, these guys are worth a ton of soul power, too, so it's easy to heal in the middle of combat. Oh, hi. Charm Notch. Um. Well, it's not one of these. Oh, wait. Charm. Oh! Oh, it's a notch! So it means I can, I can, uh, I can equip, whoops, I can equip the compass. So, uh, charm notches, I didn't know they were, uh, you can find them, but that's, that's great. <laughs> Makes my life easier. Okay, uh, but then, but when, way. Okay, I guess I'll just keep going this direction. Wow. 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 Okay. It's said there's an elevator nearby. I think it was an elevator. I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> Little runaway mushrooms make me giggle. Yeah, hopefully we find a bench sometime soon. Oh! Maybe we want to go back. I'm not entirely sure. Let's try going up. Because this might give us uh, another shortcut of sorts. I'm also just looking for a bench that I can rest on. Okay, so we can keep going up and around and there's a lot of different places to go to. Uh-oh. Oh, hey, bench! I don't really like the look of this guy, but yeah, here we are. So we've actually been through quite a lot here. Don't try to sneak past me. I can smell you. Hmm. Do you collect a lot of Geo? Well, give me Geo, and you can see something nice. Pay to see something nice, sure. Let me show you then. Take a look. Do you want them? If you really, really want them, I'll trade them for more Geo. More Geo. Okay, so we've got things. Um, this precious thing, beautiful charm, made it for you. If you hold it, you'll feel a lot healthier. Uh, do you want more Geo? Hold this charm, go hunting, bring me any Geo you find back. And fragile strength, you're weak, aren't you? You should give me Geo. If you do, I'll give you this charm I made. It'll make you stronger, your enemies and everyone else. will fear you at last. That's interesting. These are cool. So, we have a shopkeeper now. I don't know if we want to get past him. I assume we just need to give, get a bunch of cash. Uh, to make it worth it. 
Well, that's fun. Yeah, fragile strength seems like a double-edged sword. Ow, whoa, ah. Huh, did no bright bumper also shot my, my special move. Okay. And I got most spawns from bird, so we'll be on shortly. Then we can do some stuff. Okay, so let's, let's see. So we've got another fart ballooning, nah. got another fart ballooner over here uh yeah so I assume if we if we pay him enough he'll he will I'm forgetting the compass you're right I am forgetting the compass let's go back and get the compass on okay there we go I guess I could have actually equipped the Thorn of Agony. Eh, whatever. Yeah, so the thing is, like, ultimately, I haven't been using the compass too much. But now that we have the extra notch, I think I'm going to keep up with it, though. Uh, at least until we find something a little bit more attractive. The extra geo is tempting. Just because, I mean, really what I need to do is, um... I need to do a uh, farming spree at some point and just go through and make like a crap ton of cash in areas we've already been to. That seems like probably the best idea. Cause yeah, as much as I like the um as much as I like the compass, if we're just doing like geo farming, it'll probably work fairly well. Okay, uh, let's see. Anything over here? Can't go up this way? That's fine. Yeah, uh, as much... I don't know. We'll, we'll just figure it out. I, I just want to be able to afford everything. I love the upgrades in this game. Even if I'm not going to use all of them, uh, the idea of just, you know, having all of these options to roll with is a really attractive prospect. Okay, so this gets us back up to the Forgotten Crossroads, which is interesting. Because where the heck are we? Let's check the map again. Oh, we're down, like, over here? What? Oh, it's another one of these, like, rolly sections. I'm not going to be able to get through that. I don't even know what it is. So, yeah, this is one of the, uh... One of the pathways that we couldn't get through originally. But now we've got it all on... on lockdown? I don't know. Okay, uh, we actually want to come back up here for a moment. There's a, uh, there's a room we've been to. Or is this one of the ones with the vertic vertical verticality that I can't get past? I'm not entirely sure. Okay, we'll see. Okay, uh, seeing as people are surmi uh, trying to guess what the Fragile Strength does, my bet is it makes me do double damage and makes all of my enemies do double damage too. Okay, so... Fairly certain we've been here before. And there's something about me not being able to get across here. Are you serious? Well, whatever this is, I ain't able to get it. Yeah, so we're, we're gonna go get the, uh, let's get the caterpillars. And then probably go bank all of our money. Because at this point, I've got what, six? Six hundred, eight hundred dollars? Oh, jeez. It's closer than I wanted it to be. Okay, so this gets us back up. Where's the, uh, caterpillar? We've also got that, like, other weird side path that we can go through. I'm not entirely sure. I'm a bit lost, honestly. I know, I know there's like two places 
uh, there's like several places that we've been through here that we need to explore properly. Yeah, 600 is not a small amount. It's small-ish. The unfortunate part is uh, what we need is a lantern, and the lantern is like mad crazy expensive. Oh, right, this. Yeah, whatever that wall climbing ability is, we need we need that to get through there. But that's not where the caterpillar kit is. Let me see. Uh, oh, you know what? I know where caterpillar kit is. Oops. Ah. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it might be wall jumping. It might be something. But my problem is I can't tell because there's some uh, there's some areas where it's very definitively like kind of wall jumpy. Um, I know the grandpa caterpillar is just left of the entrance, but we're not here for grandpa grand ca caterpillar. We're here for the uh, we're here for this one. I think this is the only caterpillar remaining in the zone. Yeah, we've also got something over by the boss. I don't remember what was locking me out of that direction. Whatever it was, I th think it might just require the dash, but it might require the jump, too. I'm not entirely sure. Ow. Okay. Well, uh, let's go, let's go talk to Grandpappy Caterpillar Man. No reason why not to. Might as well get our financial little benefit. Okay. So he's got... A couple more of them hanging out in the back. Right, he gives us a mass fragment. I remember now. You get enough of his grandchildren, and you get one fragment of the mask. Get enough of those, and we get a health up. If I found the one hidden in the walls to the far right. Yep, I already got that one. I think I've gotten all of the ones in the hall nest. It'd be nice if the map maker actually so uh, sold a... Uh, like a... Uh, whoops. If the map maker sold like uh, collectible maps. Like if once you beat the boss for area, he's just like, yeah, here's all the shit you missed. That'd be nice. That'd be really nice actually. Okay. I wonder what happens if you get all of them. Well, let's go back up. Uh, immediately I'll be going back up to go back down so that we can get, uh... Deliver some things. Now uh, Pete has nothing new to say. Oh, her. I assume I've still... Cleared her out. Yep. Let's see. Do we want to do this? Do we want to check out the uh, the map? The one thing... Uh, okay. So I want that lamp, obviously. We could get a mass fragment here. We could also get stalwart shell. Yeah, let's, uh, let's save our dosh. Actually, what I could do is just go back to the big old vertical room and just go straight down. It'd probably actually be the fastest way to get back to useful, useful stuff. Yeah, the lamp is 1800. Yeah, that's one of the issues. Let's see, have I gone all the way left past the well? Uh, or at the right past the well. Well, there's the mine area. It's like one other thing. I don't know. I'll think on it. Uh, I, I think we're fine. Let's, I'm just going to murder my way down a little bit. We want to pick up the thing that makes it so we get more geos. Uh, because what I'm probably going to do is go um, money farming at some point here. You know, just run through probably probably not the forest. That place has some kind of toughies. I guess what we could do is actually uh, do a uh, a journal journal completion geo farming uh, little side trip. That actually would probably be the the best use of my time. 
Because that way we can um, fill it in and stuff like that. Okay. Uh, I like it how he just leaves that calling card there. And it just stays there. Forever. Okay. So we want to go this way and down. Uh, no. We want to go up over here. Ah, oh, it's so nice having the jump. By the end of this game, I'm probably going to be, like, an unbeatable badass with, like, flight moves and stuff like that. That'd actually be kind of fun, almost being able to fly after a certain point and just being like, Aha! Your platforming means nothing to me! That may be a bit on the overpowered side. Oh, the big fungus... Uh, yeah, the big fart bags have... Um, they're, uh... They're not here right now. Okay. So what do we got? We still can't go to the left because it required some kind of weird move. But, uh, let's see. Fragile gr Oh. Maybe fragile strength, heart, and greed. I, I don't know if we lose them. I hope we don't lose them. It looks like they stick around and it doesn't sell more. Yeah, so, uh, I'm gonna save up, uh... I'm gonna save up so I can use that one. Uh, let's see, so... It does look different, though. It's got, like, a bubble. I don't know. Either way, I'm not gonna be using it for the time being. I just wanna buy it, because if we can fill... If we can buy everything that he sells... Yeah, doesn't look like I can get through there. Uh, if we can buy everything he sells, maybe we can, uh, get him to move. Like, that might be one of the, the things that he does. Ow. Stupid fart ball. At least they give plenty of soul power. Okay. Oh, did it say that it breaks if the wear is killed? Oh, yeah. We'll break if the wear is killed. Okay. <laughs> There's actually a special animation there. Yeah, okay. Purple had it right. Well, I probably won't be using it that often then. Oh, interesting. There's like a chained up door thing. Well, that's cool. Okay. Oh, it killed itself. Aha! I guess that's one of the tricks to use against him. Oh, shit. Wow, that hurt. Worth it, probably. But why not put the badge on? It gives you money. Uh, that is going to be... Oh. That is going to be something that I pretty much only use uh, when I'm exploring areas I've already been to. I refuse to use something that... Um, that valuable. In a situation where I'm probably going to die. We remember the Elder. Well, I don't know what it is for later. But yeah, if you notice, I've only got two HP left. Um, let's see. If you find a chest, uh, equip it then. Can't actually. You can't hot swap, um... You can't hot swap badges, which kind of sucks. Cloth. Aha! The tiny steps of a tiny creature. You look, you've got the look of an adventurer. We've got, so we've much in common. Searching for dangerous places, I? Well, you're on the right track. A long neck critter warned me of a tribe deeper down. Warrior sorts, so she says, and I'm itching for some serious combat. Keep sharp, my adventurous friend. Stay alive, and let's meet again on the road ahead. Okay. 
So she's probably maybe how we learn how to bust through stuff. I'm not entirely sure. Okay. What? There we go. Okay. So I haven't been through this room yet. And damn it. And we die. <laughs> Whoops. And that's why we don't have the uh, fragile what's it what's it moves it's. Cause I don't know how to fix that. Uh I don't know how to fix it, and I don't have the money for that yet either. Okay, well, let's just be careful. And go the other way. Missed my jump for a second there. Well, at least I don't have to fight a whole lot of things. Bat! Okay. Oh, well, this sucks. Uh, let's get my HP back. Can it break even if I don't have it equipped? No. It said wearer, if I remember right. There we go. Okay. So, we can still get our HP back up. It just sucks a bit. Uh, let's see. Yep. As usual, watch your step. Something I'm not a particularly good, uh... I'm not very good at the whole watch your step kind of dealio. At least we're already back to where we were. Yeah, it looks like... Oh, no, she's back. She's fun. I... <sighs> I almost hope the developers of this game do a Shovel Knight thing. Like, it'd be really cool if you could, uh... If you could actually play as some of the other characters in this game. Like, I, I'd, I'd enjoy a, um... I'd, I'd enjoy very temporarily... Or, not temporarily, but, like, doing a campaign as Hornet. Like, that'd be enjoyable. She seems fun. Okay, there we go. Oh, you can break them on the ground. That's interesting. Okay, so we've got some kind of shrine thing in a building, and maybe... I don't know. I'm just looking for benches. I actually don't know what happens if I just quit while I'm adventuring around. Because I think I just heard bird, finally. Out. Ha oh, that's Hornet. So I guess we're following her. Okay, stay away from that for a second. Uh, let's see. Nothing over here. There's a big old shrine. I don't know. Can I just can I just quit the menu? I think I can. Okay. We'll see where that puts me. Hopefully just at the beginning of the beginning of the room, maybe.